AMD aims to push the envelope at CES 2020, reveals CES press conference date AMD President and CEO Dr. Lisa Su will host. Something to look forward to, in the world of technology, January is a significant time of the year, as it heralds the arrival of the annual Consumer Electronics Show, CES. This year, CES 2020 takes place January 7 to 10 in Las Vegas, Nevada. While it surprises no one that AMD plans to have a presence at the show, Team Red has made it official with a press conference date. AMD closed out 2019 by announcing its press conference, scheduled for Monday, January 6 at 2 p.m. PSD at the Mandalay Bay. None other than Dr. Lisa Su will be hosting the event. AMD also declared that it will push the envelope in terms of high-performance computing this year. A live stream of the event will take place on AMD's YouTube channel with an archived version appearing two hours after the stream. At hashtag CES 2020, AMD will push the envelope yet again to make 2020 an incredible year for high-performance computing. Join us for our press conference on Monday, January 6 at 2 p.m. PT on YouTube. AMD, at AMD, December 31, 2019. While it's anyone's guess as to what AMD has up its sleeve for CES this year, there have been some rumblings. AMD is prepping its Ryzen 4000 lineup that will be underpinned by the Zen 3 architecture, and there's a chance AMD might be ready to talk about it. However, CES seems a bit early, and we'd wager a Computex 2020 announcement is more likely for Zen 3. There's also the rumored Threadripper 3980X, reportedly boasting 48 cores and 96 threads. Additionally, there's the RX 5600 XT, with rumored performance somewhere between NVIDIA's GTX 1660T and RTX 2060. It's possible AMD may take the wraps off the mid-range card at CES 2020. Then, there's talk of AMD's RDNA 2 architecture, built on a 7 nanometers plus process that is supposed to power big Navi and bring with it hardware accelerated ray tracing. At any rate, we won't have to wait long to see what AMD has in store. If 2019 was any indication, 2020 should be an interesting year for computing. For more on this story, visit the news article link.